Good morning, everyone. I'm meteorologist Violet Skyber. We're expecting another chilly start to the day, especially considering the wind. It's making it feel a lot colder than it actually is. Right now, the current conditions in Syracuse seeing plenty of sunshine starting near zero degrees. We were in the negatives about an hour ago, but notice what it feels like with this east wind around seven miles per hour. It actually feels about negative 13 in Syracuse and feeling like the negatives for everywhere else as well. We are going to see improving conditions this afternoon. Again, a cold start, but warming up quickly with plenty of sunshine today and a high near 28 this afternoon with a light breeze as well. Going towards late this afternoon, we'll have increasing clouds with snow arriving around 7 or 8 p.m. in from the south, becoming widespread about 10 p.m. tonight and staying that way in the overnight hours with a low near 19. We will have some mixing with ice and sleet and freezing rain as we go towards tomorrow morning and during the middle of the day. We could see some slippery road conditions because of that. For right now, a live look from our triple Doppler radar sponsored by Falso Service Experts. Sunshine to start today and expecting to hang on to that for the rest of today. But we will get increasing clouds as we go towards sunset as winter storm Izzy looks to slide through the Carolinas and up the East Coast, hitting us from the south. And that's why we're going to get snow on the north end of this system. Again, it hits the southern tier around 7 or 8, becoming widespread overnight tonight and even continuing through the day tomorrow. And we're expecting a decent amount of snowfall accumulation, at least for some parts of our area. That's why we have a winter storm warning for the north country and areas out to the west. For Onondaga County and areas to the south and east, we're under a winter weather advisory where we're expecting lesser snowfall amounts. And along with some sleet and freezing rain, some ice accumulation as well. Let's time this out for you. Right now, temperatures have already climbed into the single digits. We started in the negatives. Now we're around zero in Syracuse. We'll be warming up quickly with that sunshine today. By lunchtime, about 20 degrees and then reaching the upper 20s this afternoon. We'll have increasing clouds around sunset with mostly cloudy skies by 5 p.m. Snow works its way in from the south, reaching the southern tier by about 7 p.m. Then 10 p.m. is when it becomes widespread and it continues that way overnight. Even some heavy pockets of snow mixed in there as well with a decent amount of snow on the ground by Monday morning. Looking ahead to Monday, starting the morning with some widespread light snow, even some dry pockets mixed in there for central New York, but also we'll get some warmer air working its way in with a wintry mix possible. Could see some sleet and freezing rain for areas around Syracuse south and east of us. As we go towards the afternoon, highs will reach the lower 30s. And then on the back end of this weather system, Monday evening and night, we'll get another cold air mass dropping in that will change that back over to snow. How much snowfall we can expect by Monday night? The heaviest out to the west, around a foot or more out by Rochester. Most of the Finger Lakes regions around 8 to 12 inches. Then in Syracuse and south of us, we'll see 4 to 8 inches with the least amounts to the south and east in the Mohawk Valley, just about 2 to 4. And that's also where we'll see some ice accumulation from sleet and freezing rain, just about a glaze. A check of your 7-day forecast. Again, sunshine today near 28. Widespread snow Monday near 33. Then on Tuesday, lake effect snow showers, a high near 20. With some scattered rain and snow showers Wednesday, a high near 38 before chilly weather for the end of the week. Melanie?